So, for the purposes of research for my forthcoming book, I read some stuff, and among the stuff that I read was the philosophical essay, The Last Messiah, by Peter Wessel Zoff. Now, Peter Wessel Zoff was a Norwegian philosopher, among other things, whose perspective was colored by deep pessimism and antinatalism, and I was first made aware of this essay thanks to this book right here, The Conspiracy Against the Human Race by Thomas Ligotti, which I read and reviewed last year, also for the purposes of research. In this book, Thomas Ligotti makes reference to Zopp's essay, The Last Messiah, so I decided to track it down and give it a read, and it is free to read online. Feel free to uh, give that a Google give it a good read because uh, I would say it's definitely worth a read. So in this essay, The Last Messiah, Peter Wessel Zoff takes a very bleak view of human existence and he basically says it really isn't worth it. Life sucks and we know it sucks, but we lie to ourselves about that. He postulates that uh, consciousness was an accident of nature which allowed human beings to attain a true and full grasp of their own existence and thereby recognize just how bad and how terrifying it really is. Now this I actually would disagree with him about. I do not think that consciousness was an accident at all. In fact, I think consciousness is quite literally was and is the point of everything. However, disagreements aside, this work is still remarkable and remarkably well written as well. Peter Wessel Zoff really could spin a good sentence, uh, but he goes on to lay out uh, how he views that people uh, come to terms with their existence and make do with things even though there's a nagging part in the back of their mind that tells them that it really isn't worth it. And he says that they do so through methods such as isolation, anchorage, distraction, and sublimation. Now, the motif which lends to this work, its title, The Last Messiah, is Zoff's uh, posited uh, prophet-like figure who has extended their thought and reasoning uh, when it comes to evaluating human existence and life all the way to the logical conclusion and have determined that uh, it's not worth it, it sucks, and it should be abandoned, and that this person will preach this message to the masses who will promptly tear them apart because people generally don't like to hear such sentiments espoused. But um, this is a really neat essay, and my purpose here with this video is just to kind of review it, give an overview of it, but also uh, maybe to kind of give a platform for it maybe introduce it to some other people out there who might like to give it a read because again it's free you can just read it online it's only about like 10 pages long uh, but it packs a punch it definitely does and uh, I can see uh, Thomas Ligotti definitely draws a lot uh, from it because he in in his book also uh, posits that consciousness is an accident of nature which again I disagree with I think consciousness is the point of nature but um, disagreements aside, again, uh, The Last Messiah is a really uh, nifty work to read, kind of unsettling if you haven't ever been exposed to that kind of uh, thought before. But if you are looking to dip your toes into the waters of philosophical pessimism and antinatalism, I would highly encourage you to give this a read because it is a great uh, launch point, I would say, for it. So, The Last Messiah by Peter Wessel Zopp. Have you read the Last Messiah, or have you read Thomas Ligotti's book, uh, The Conspiracy Against the Human Race? If you have, let me know down in the comments what you thought about it, uh, uh, whether you have agreed or disagreed with, with it or anything I've said here today. And if you haven't, uh, like I said, I could definitely recommend it because I think it's well worth a read. And as always, if you have enjoyed anything you've seen or heard here today, remember to hit that like button and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. And until next time, peace.